Good morning everyone. Today I will discuss about a school of psychology and structuralism. So what, what is school, a school of psychology? School of psychology means a group of psychologists having similar viewpoints and approaches to study human mind and behavior constitute a school of thought in psychology. The important school of psychology are was structuralism, functionalism, behavioralism, psychoanalysis, gestalt psychology. Now discuss about structuralism. Structuralism is a school of psychology devoted for the study of elements of consciousness. The major thinker associated with in the major thinker associated include Wilhelm owned Edward Tischner. Wilhelm Owned was the father of structuralism. He opened world first psycho psychological laboratory in Beijing in 1879. The other notable psychologist was belonging to the schools Tischner, Weber and Fitchner. The focus of structuralism was on reducing mental process into the basic elements. Edward Tischner was the student of Wilhelm Owned. Edward Tischner renamed structure voluntarism as structuralism. The structuralist used techniques such as introspection to analyze human mind. Now, what is introspection? Introspection simply means uh, Looking into own mind, shall I say, inner processes of human mind. Matlab, apne andar ki knowledge ko gain karna. Now the, uh, and introspection was the first method of structuralism. Now the uh, importance of structuralism. Edward uh, B. Tichner was... Uh, Edward P. Tischner believed that the goal of psychology is uh, mind and consciousness. Consciousness is the sum total of mental experiences and mind is the sum total of various mental experiences like thoughts, imagination, attention, etc. So, what is about uh, consciousness? Consciousness has जो हम सोचते हैं जैसे कि सुख और दुख और सही और गलत को पहचानते हैं वो होता है कॉन्शियसनेस की वजह से और कॉन्शियसनेस जो जो हमारे अंदर हमारे कोई थॉट चल रही हो और वो हम सोच के एक्ट करें वो होता है कॉन्शियसनेस कॉन्शियसनेस बिटवीन थ्री टाइप्स कॉन्शियस माइंड सबकॉन्शियस माइंड अनकॉन्शियस माइंड सबकॉन्शियस माइंड होता है जो काम करने के लिए हमें कुछ सोचना नहीं पड़ता क्योंकि वो हमारी डेली रूटीन में बन चुकी है वो हम डायरेक्टली ऐसे कर सकते हैं एंड अनकॉन्शियस माइंड इज हमारे पास्ट प्रेजेंट और फ्यूचर को अनकॉन्शियस माइंड एक शेप देते हैं आप हाँ लोग अनकॉन्शियस माइंड में आप कोई भी क्वेश्चन पूछ सकते हो इंटरनेट या गूगल की तरह जिसका जवाब आपको मिलेगा आपकी ड्रीम्स और इंट्यूशन पे और इम्पोर्टेंट स्ट्रक्चरलिज्म नंबर टू पॉइंट इज देर इज नो इट इज नो रिलेशन बिटवीन माइंड एंड बॉडी नाउ द कंट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ स्ट्रक्चरलिज्म इट गिव एन एक्सपेरिमेंटल मेथड फॉर स्टार्टिंग ह्यूमन behavior that is experimental introspection number two is it initiated a spirit of science and experimental in the field of education so this is about contribution now the limitation of structuralism structuralism is too concerned with internal behavior which is not directly observable and cannot be measured accurately measured and second point is, it cannot be study of children and mentally defective, initials, humans and animals. So, 
this is all about limitation. However, it is not that structuralism lacks significance. It is important because it is the it is the first major school of structuralism. The also influenced the development of experimental psychology. So that's all about structuralism. Thank you.